Ballet Kelowna dancers are doing one final run through before opening the doors to the general public Tuesday and Wednesday night at the Kelowna Community Theatre. Well, in celebration of Ballet Kelowna's 15th anniversary, we're producing our first full-length ballet, A Streetcar Named Desire. It's set to premiere tomorrow night, May 1 and May 2, here at the Kelowna Community Theatre. This is a very exciting moment for the company. This ballet is based on Tennessee Williams' Pulitzer Prize-winning play, and it tells the story of two sisters, Stella and Blanche. Um, and uh, Blanche is coming from Old World, New uh, Mississippi, and uh, arriving in New Orleans post-World War II. Um, this uh, ballet is full of uh, dramatic effects um, and very interesting characters, um, and has a very strong narrative, beautiful costumes, some really interesting sets that we've put together for this production, um, as well as dancers from the Victoria Academy of Ballet are joining us on stage uh, with our professional dancers from Ballet Kelowna. So we have 15 dancers on stage uh, for this particular production. This is going to be a real milestone moment in the history of Ballet Kelowna, and I hope people will come and check out this spectacular production. Um, I had the honour of premiering the work back in 2006 for Ballet BC. I was the original Blanche Dubois in the production, and I'm very happy to pass along this role um, to our dancers, um, as well as all the information regarding the characters in this very, very um, beautiful ballet. So I hope people will come check it out. For tickets, you can go to ColonaTickets.com. For Castanet News, I'm Rob Balston in Kelowna. Got the edge? Go to OkanaganEdge.net and click the link in the top right. Fill out the form and show the Okanagan you've got the edge.